Hello everyone. In this video, we will learn how to enable the Power Query add-in for Excel 2013. I've got this Excel 2013 workbook open with me and as you can see, Power Query is not installed. Once Power Query gets installed, you get a separate tab for Power Query. So to install Power Query, I need to check the version of Excel I have on, whether it's a 32-bit or a 64-bit version. So let us check that first. Click on the File menu and then go on to Account. Click on About Excel. On the pop-up, you can see on the top Microsoft Excel 2013 and, and towards the end it says 64-bit. So I need to install a 64-bit version. I go to Google and type Download Power Query 2013. And as you can see, this is the first link that I get. I have got it open here. And I click on the download button and it shows whether I want the 64-bit or the 32-bit version. I can click this and click next. It will start downloading it. So I already have Power Query downloaded on my uh, downloads folder. So, um, but before I install it, I have to close the Excel workbook. Excel workbook needs to be closed. Right click on the installable and click install. Click next. Click on I accept the user agreement. And so as you can see, it starts installing the Power Query. Power Query is installed. Let us open Excel 2013 again. As you can see, I still don't have the Power Query tab. I need to enable it. To do that, I go on File again, and I go on Options, and then I go to Add-ins. So you can see here that I've got the Power Query add-in, but I have to make it active now. So since it's a COM add-in, we go on COM add-in and click Go. And it shows us all the available plugins. So I check that Power Query for Excel and click OK. And you can see now that Power Query tab is available to me and I can use Power Query. I hope you found this video useful and thanks for watching this video.